representing Cerberus strength. These are my knee wraps. These are my knees. I'm going to show you how I put mine on. Then I'm going to do a quick little set for you. Uh, a lot of people just start at the bottom and work their way up. I believe in a crisscross, a little extra safety for the knee. So I'll start and go from the inside out so that it comes across this part of my knee and stays up there. It seems to stay in place a little longer. So the first pass is to lock it in place. Then we cross. This will lock that into place. Then we're going to cross back over the knee. I'm going to go one good tight one over the patella. And then the rest of them just right up the knee. So you don't advocate a more candy cane style? Candy canes have their place. There's no doubt of that. But I find that if they do the candy cane, it leaves an opportunity for them to split as you go down. And nothing more dangerous than an exposed kneecap on a heavy squat. Or as sad as a split candy cane. Right. Crossed. I keep my legs slightly bent too. And crisscross applesauce. Protect the patella. Now, clearly it's not very tight. These are the middle of the road uh, service wraps. They've got a set that are not quite as stiff, and they've got another set that are quite a bit stiffer. I'm not quite ready for those, but I think once I start repping 700, I'll go for the uh, extra stiff. Set, extra stiff. Once it gets a little harder, I'll go for the stiff ones. See what I did there? This is not a Cerberus belt, although I wish I had one. <laughs> Extra sass from Kringle. Even he has a Christmas list. Go to Cerberus.com, CerberusStrength.com, order it, use code BigBadSanta, save yourself some cash.